No, I, I know. Just pointing out I'm for anyone the who's Quran, the only verse you could be referring to is this particular verse. That's it. Okay, yes. now this verse in doesn't. In the clear and concise the, yeah, Quran. Yeah, in the clear and concise Quran, it doesn't say the Trinity consists of Ma, uh, Mary this and that. No, it's an inference. That's what I That's your inference okay. is wrong. I'm saying that your inference is. Hi, hey guys, you're welcome back. So. A Christian lady had an heated conversation with a Muslim concerning Islam and Christianity. So let's check it out, guys. The, the Trinity of the Quran is not what anyone's been discussing for hundreds of years. It, that's Father, Son and Holy Spirit as opposed to Mary. Do you see? So it's an utterly different Trinity to the one that Allah references in what? the Quran. Yeah, but the Quran doesn't say the Trinity includes Mary. It does. No, it doesn't. Well, he says, don't take... Uh, did, I, did I tell... He's speaking to Isa. He said, "I didn't yeah. tell you to say." Well, your if mother for example, and look, let's let's me. let's say for example, which Ibn it, Ibn, Ibn Taymiyyah wrote a book called the Jawab al Sahih, yeah, right. which was a response to Christians, yeah. It's called the uh, the fitting response or something like that, or the correct response. And in it, he has a whole chapter where he talks about the the Trinity that the Quran mentions. Yes. And in it, he's he's let's just say an apparentist. He looks at the apparent meanings. He says that the Quran doesn't doesn't specify what, who's in the Trinity. I'm not saying Muhammad Hijab has. Excuse, let me finish. Let me finish. I'm not saying Muhammad Hijab's opinion on the Quranic verses are X because Muhammad Hijab's on the uh, Quranic verses are irrelevant to the majority of people. I'm not a no, master that's exegete. Not true. You've got no, a no, lot no, of people who listen no problem. To you. But the only people that listen to me are those who want to see me transmit the information of the big scholars of the past. So I'm telling you, Ibn Taymiyyah who died at 728 AH, a good 700 years ago, he wrote in his book called the Jawab Sahiyah. He said that there's a chapter where he talks about what Sorry, the... Sorry, can I just have a Let me finish. 700 AH is only 700 years ago. 728 so like AH, which is after, Hij after AD, Hijri. Like, after yeah. Hijri, yeah? Okay, 13th yeah. century uh, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, AD, okay? okay yeah, so anyway, uh, it's like th uh, 1328 or something like that, right? What I'm saying is that Ibn Taymiyyah writes in his book, there's a whole chapter that's dedicated to, does the Quran... He answers this question, which you're bringing to me now. Does the Quran specify a kind of trinity? His answer is it, it doesn't. So it includes all the. He actually says this includes all the models of Trinity that Christians have believed in historically. Which Christians believed in Mary and Isa and Allah? I've already told you the Quran doesn't specify that. You'd have to bring no, me no, the it's evidence. Reference? Well, it's in the Quran. No, it's not in the Quran. Well, there are no uh, messages from Allah in the. For example, uh, Allah subhanahu wa taala. Look, the only, when Allah says in Quran, do not take yeah. my me and my mum ilahain to two lords. That is because we are alongside Allah. Right? Yeah, fine, fine. Yeah. It doesn't say in the Quran that Mary and Mary and it Jesus are part of the Trinity. It says, D uh, "Did you ask them that you yeah. took you and your mum as a Lord?" Now let me okay. ask. Let me so tell you that something. Hold on. Implies that Allah has seen a time when this is believed because no, he's it, asking. All, it, him, so all did, you, did you say it? All it implies is that Christians do tali or they uh, they create a divine relationship with Mary. Now, if you look at what the Quran's understanding. Of worshippers, for example, Allah says in the Quran, "Afaraita man ittaqada ilahu hawa." Have you seen the one who has taken his own self as a god? Right. Yeah. Like the pagans, mm. I guess, maybe. Individuals who uh, act upon, who make their desire the ultimate authority. Yeah. yeah? They make a god in their own image. Uh, the, the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said in the Hadith, "Ta'isa abdu dinari dirham," that cursed is the one who worships the coin, the dinar and the dirham, money, basically, mm. money worshipper. And now, if your if your theory held that everywhere the Quran and Sunnah uh, talked about a different type That's of God. And I'm just saying, yeah. you understand that to the Quran dictates or tells us that there are certain ways in which a human being can take something or someone as a God. The way in which Mary is seen as to be taken as a God is that the kind of worship that we would consider, especially Venerate Roman Catholics, yeah. Venerate, call it whatever you like, yeah, yeah. Roman Catholics in particular, mm -hmm. who call her the mother of God, yeah. yeah? We would consider this and Protestants would actually agree and that's why I find it is uh, you as a Protestant I find it uh, quite uh, shocking that you're asking me this. I'm not asking yeah, you yeah. but Catholics yeah, don't uh, believe the Trinity yeah, doesn't have the Holy Spirit. I, no, no, I didn't say it. Uh, the, I that. said it. No, no. no I, I, I I'm know. just pointing out I'm, for anyone who's The Quran, familiar. the only verse you could be referring to is this particular verse. That's it. Okay, yes. now this verse in doesn't... In the clear and concise the, yeah, Quran. Yeah, in the clear and concise Quran it doesn't say the Trinity consists of Ma, uh, Mary this and that. No, it's an inference. That's what I That's your inference okay. is wrong. I'm saying that your inference is... is oh, there is, are other references to a differing trinity within about, say, not three. The Quran doesn't, doesn't specify it doesn't. who... It does okay, not... So my next question. The Quran doesn't specify who are in the... Who's in the trinity. Yeah. Doesn't specify. That's Excellent. why I'm saying that Ibn Taymiyyah mentions in his book, Jab Sahih, who died 700 years ago. Mm. He's saying that because the Quran does, he doesn't specify for a reason. 
so that it can include all of the models of Trinity. Let me give you, let me, let me give you an example, right? In, in the first 300 years of Christianity, the Holy Spirit was not seen as a divine, co-equal, co-eternal. What's your source for that? I'll tell you, uh, J.M.D. Kelly, right? J a modern author. Yeah, it's a modern author, Christian author. Well, there's there's only the one that you can bring. Roman, then it's not Jesus just was let me, let me finish. Let me finish. All three, let me finish. All three were yeah, yeah, okay. the uh, You tell me what's my source. I've given you your yeah. source, yeah? Okay, JND, I don't accept that source. You don't have to accept it. No problem. I'm saying that he gives us primary sources. He, give, he, 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 he quote, gives the primary sources. Okay. He gives more than one primary source evidence. Let me so tell you what. He, the Bible is his primary yes, he does. Source. Yes, he does. Of course he does. But let me, let me, let me yeah. stop saying things you don't know. I do know. You, okay, who's Jane, who is Jane Dean Kelly? What's his, the, what's his book? Sorry, I'm, what's I'm he talking you about? what I'm saying. You've misunderstood what I'm saying. I'm saying the Bible does not, the New Testament doesn't give any verses that imply anyway, the Holy Spirit is not God. Let, let me tell you something. Jane Dean Kelly makes the following argument. Or he, he, he's not even making an argument, he's, he's narrating history. He's saying that, look, for example, if you look at the primary source material, if you look at the Nicene Creed of 325, yeah? Yes. You will find that the Father is mentioned, yes, the, Holy, the Son is mentioned, yes, the Holy Spirit is mentioned. Yes. But the Holy Spirit is not mentioned as co-equal and co-eternal God. Lord, give her a blight. Lord, Lord. He's when only... Jesus let, let, let me finish, let me finish. When Jesus so, was baptized, stop, stop, stop. all three were stop, together. Stop, 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 stop. All stop. three were together. He's not what are you saying? He's not, he's not, he's not yeah. mentioned as co-equal and co-eternal with, with God. Uh, with, uh, with, uh, with Father Sam. So, uh, Charles, so, 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 no, before Chalcedon, yeah, in, Const in Constantinople, because you said Chalcedon is 451. No, because there's so, a no. split, there's a rift after uh, yeah, that where yeah, he yeah, proceeds fine. from. I, you're right. Yeah. But what I'm saying before that, you mentioned Chalcedon. The Bible. You, you mentioned Chalcedon. Chalcedon, Chalcedon is 451. Yes, I'm saying in 381, mm -hmm. that's when now, right before 381, when there was a Constantinopolean creed, yes. a Constantinople creed, that's when you had the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, co equal, co eternal. Now, in the, in the, in the interim, Nicaea. in the interim, it's after, so 381, and I see it's 325. Oh, 38, All right, so you've got 325, you've got the Father and the Son, both are co equal, co eternal. The Holy Spirit is not co equal. He's the Lord giver of life. He's the Lord giver of life, no problem. But it's not co equal, co eternal, God. Yeah? I'm saying in the free. We believe hold on, hold on. In the Holy Spirit, know, the Lord, I, I, the giver of life. So that implies know, divinity. Not really. Because we don't believe no, no, no. in anything other than divinity. Hold on, divinity. Give, me, give me a second. Yeah. I, understand, I know what you believe. I'm just yeah. saying that this is how your belief developed. 325. Give me a second. Okay. 325, when there was the Aryan controversy, and then after yes. the subsequent Nicene Creed, that's what happened. 381 now, now you have the Constantinopian Creed. Now what happened between? You had the Cappadocian Fathers. Okay? The Cappadocian Fathers, who Jane D. Kelly mentioned, uh, Gregory of Nyssa, Be Basil, of uh, these three, three men, okay? The, the question was, what is the status of the Holy Spirit? Yes. Okay, now this question of what is the status of the Holy Spirit, itself the fact that there was a question was it a creature was it an angel was it whatever after the question was raised that's why one of the main reasons why they started doing another uh, another council in 381 and when they did the other council the holy spirit was recognized thereafter recognized not it not imputed no but listen see? it was recognized Meaning there it's always been and listen please let, let me just finish they, it was recognized they were recognized it was recognized thereafter as co-equal and co-eternal yes. now theodosius the second who was in charge of the Roman Empire at the time, he then forced this decree by force. Anyone who went against the Constantinopolitan Creed of 381 would be uh, banished, would be persecuted or Do whatever. Do you disapprove of people who enforce laws? No, I haven't, made a more, I, haven't, I haven't made a moral. I haven't. made a moral judgment. I'm just telling no, you history. You, I'm just, I haven't yeah. made a moral judgment. Why you said force? I have no, no that problem. Wanted yes, yeah, I do. By the way, I do. But that's a separate discussion. No, anyway, a, no problem. Yeah. yeah, that's what you think. That's your uh, yeah. distorted understanding. Three eighty. Well, the don't want to be killed. No, listen, surely. Whatever. Yes. Okay. Three eighty one. Theodosius II. He enforced the Constantinopolitan Creed, which now had the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit as co-equal co In other words. If you look at, and this is why I dare you and I challenge you and I challenge the whole Christian world and I have been doing so the for the last, Christian yeah, yeah, I've, I've been years. doing so for the last half decade and I have no response. Give me one church father. Yes. One simple church father. A simple one. Okay. Yeah, from yeah. Free, first 300 years. One. Okay, whatever, whatever. Stop wasting my time. Oh, 300, 300 years. Listen, give me one church father, 300 years of Christianity, right. before uh, Nicene Creed. Yep. Well, who's, who stated categorically yep. that the Holy Spirit mm -hmm. was co-equal and co-eternal with the Father and the Son. I, and then I'm I will try and answer you that without yeah. any reference. Give me one name. Say, no, I'm going to use logic. I'm going to say that in I order... I want logic. I want names. Okay. In order... This is my answer. And then I've got one final question. With if um, no one would have been discussing it if some people did not believe it, some church fathers who met up to discuss it, if there was no dissent 
again, do you know what I mean? If the no, idea I don't know what you mean. Give me one okay, name. Okay, you tell me one church council where a brand new idea has sprung up at tea time, like while they're what, just getting the, their biscuits. Well, the area in controversy. No, Arius already held those views. Okay, so what are you talking about? I'm saying that there must have been church fathers who believed it in order for it to be. So discussed. give me one, give me evidence. I'll find one. I'll come. When are you back, roughly? Uh, this is what I'm saying. You, you don't, don't even know. know. He doesn't know when he's back. Okay. I don't know when I'm back. Thing. Is that the only no, thing you can tell me? No, I'll find it and I'll put it into your YouTube. Uh, oh, no, no, no. All I'm saying to you is Excellent. that. Now get me one question. church Brilliant. father for the first 300 years. I will. Look, my claim is this. Okay. That they, look, if you look at the primary source materials of early Christianity. From the time that the earliest documents were found, for example, yeah. the DDK in the first hundred years of yes, Christianity. I like the DDK. Uh, uh, yeah, you like it, but it yeah. doesn't have anything about your trinity in it. If you look at the DDK <laughs> from the first hundred years, it doesn't. Yes, Not yours. Allah's one, yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, Allah's one is the one which includes oh, your one as well. Yeah, it's mentioned. Yeah. So anyway, the, the first, no. first anyway, the first three hundred years, years give me father. one church father. father. Who so believes in that the Holy Spirit is co-equal and co-eternal? Okay, I'll do that, man. She's saying you're, you don't need to I keep clarifying. I've got an idea in my mind. I want to double check that I'm right. I know you're saying you've got an idea. What's your idea? Say it now if you're brave. If I'm brave? Yeah, say it. Be, be brave. You say you got an idea. I want to hear it. Yeah. The people want to hear it. He wants to hear it. He wants to hear it. What is your idea? What is your idea? The writers of the Bible we were inspired by the Holy Spirit. Our church fathers. Excuse me, I haven't finished my point yet. Okay. Our church fathers, and they did believe it. But that's another thing. So now, Allah. So now, that's not another thing. That's an answer. That's an answer. But I wanted to go. Is that your idea? Oh, help me. Right. The point. Why did you come and debate me today? I came to ask you when we could debate, and you said, no, right, no, why are you why being aggressive you when I'm I need to... I'm not being aggressive, I'm just I'm winning the argument. Bit. Okay, so do you... Hey, do you, you, mind what, right, what are, you are you done here? No. Allah says... <laughs> okay. Allah says that okay. if Christians do not stand upon that which we believe, he won't be very pleased. What he verse are you talking us. about? Uh, is anyone, have you got come here with references. Where? I can't believe this. Everyone knows about religion. Please, I think we're done. We're done here. Are we done? Are we done here? I think we must be. If you can't remember, are we done here? Quran verse. Are we done here? I've just answered you. No, you haven't. The point is, I'm making is this. Oh no, you're making a point when we're done. Are we done? I said, are we done? And I said, if you can't remember the verse of the Quran, we're not making it. You're not putting any verse. Allah says that Christians must stand on what they believe. What are you talking about? I'm talking about the Quran. Which you verse? remember it. Which I verse? don't know the verse. So don't Does that mean about. it doesn't exist, that I don't know it? No, I don't know what Is you're the Quran about. subjective? Does it cease no, to no, exist no, if no, I don't the, remember the, the verse? Only, the closest thing I can think about, which you're saying is, لَسْتُمْ عَلَىٰ شَيْءٍ حَتَّى تُقِيمُ التَّوْرَاةَ وَالْإِنْجِيلِ that like, you're not on anything except if you uphold the Torah. I tell you what, I'm going to wander that's, around, that, I'm going to find that, it and I'll come back to you. Give me a okay? reference because I can't I will help do. you out I here. I will, but I've only got the one phone, so it's difficult because I'm using it to film. Okay, is this your best effort? Best effort at what? Is this your best effort? At what? At trying to produce an argument for Christianity? No. Okay. Clearly not. I'm using it for you. So why have you waited 11 months to see me and this is the best you can con- <laughs> This is the best you can see. Who are you? Just that Someone interest. you've Who come you? to me. You said you're not an Islamic <laughs> you come to, you you come to me. He said he's only repeating. I'm important, the, I'm important yeah, no, enough for you to, to notice. I came to ask him a question about when we would debate the... Excuse me. You're about 12. When he... He's before not 12. Before the lockdown... 13. Before the lockdown, we well, agreed what, and something I came like? to ask you. Stop changing. Stop obfuscating. It's embarrassing. Why are you trying to attack the man? It's embarrassing. He's... He's a very good looking man. Look at him. Very good looking man. Mohammed's on a bit... You don't want her? That makes a lot of... join the queue. Mohammed. Like, try and do your beard justice. You're a big man and you're just being childish at the moment. Okay, thank you very much. Excellent, you're welcome. So, there are two points that I was making, but the third is I approached you not for a debate. I approached you to ask when we could debate the thing that you've forgotten about. Because fair enough, it was so I, I, long haven't, ago. I haven't got time for he this. He said, all right then, Kay. Listen, you, you haven't got time for this. If you just prepare yourself when you meet me, I, I gave you a chance to How present you know your. You were here? Listen, if what, you. I'm supposed to follow your schedule. Wait a minute, I'm wait here a minute. every week. Wait a minute. Yeah. If you're here every week yeah. and you are coming to me yeah. and you want to speak to me. I did about the thing we agreed. And you're not preparing the that. Thing we that agreed. You are not preparing the arguments or yeah. the conversation that you want to compare. You, you want to speak you about. You seem a bit busy with all the uh, bringing down Islam thing. So I, I sort of put that on the back burner. I didn't really look at the flat So if I was stuff. bringing down Islam, why are you standing in my way as a Christian apologist? Well, you should I'm let not, me bring it down I'm some not, more. I'm not. I'll let you get on with the Captain Caveman haircut. Everything. I didn't say a word, did I? This is the second. Did I? By the way, this is the second. This is the time. second reference that she's made to my to appearance. Your haircut, my yeah. beard, my You've hair. You've been telling me how good looking this boy is. I'm, I'm worried what she's going to say next. <laughs> well, we won't bring in the shirt then. All right, then. Thanks very much. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you later. You will. Excuse me, sir. How are you, brother? Good. Good man. You're looking good nowadays, man. Even going to the gym a little bit. I like it. Who does your hair? 
K1 sooner. She loves the hairstyles. Where's the Jewish man? They left. They left. Oh my god. <laughs> Where is the. Uh, how had the Jewish people to speak to? Where are they? Oh, no, oh, he's speaking to Ali Dao. Fine, he's in good hands. <laughs> let me speak to you. <laughs> Come on, let me speak to you. Yeah, go ahead. Let's talk, not talk about religion today. Let me talk to you about something very important to you. Okay, go ahead. What is your name? Tyler! <laughs> this is how Muslims are. <laughs> <laughs> He's telling me about Ekel. That's that. That proves I'm tourist. Oh, Jahel, the Muslims are. That proves how Jahel is tourist. Following their Jahel. Oh, you know, you're right. No, man, no, man. Can you Jahel like them? Oh, yeah, let's take this off. Let's find someone else. <laughs> don't bless me, don't bless me, they are like their prophets. <laughs> they are dying like their prophets. <sighs> oh my goodness. So this woman actually waited 11 months. And this is all she could present. Oof. I know the pressure. I'm sure it's because of the pressure. Just imagine the kind of atmosphere she is. She's the only Christian among all of them. So I'm sure that's the reason why, even though she has a lot of facts or a lot of things to say about Christianity, but because of the atmosphere alone, she might have forgotten or that would have made her feel bad or maybe a mood or you, you get it something might have happened for her not to be able to give enough explanation because you can't tell me you waited for 11 months to actually speak to somebody about religion and you are not fully prepared the woman said something about quran verse that in the quran allah said christians should stand on what they believe in is it true because she said she saw it in the Quran, but since she's not a Muslim, she does not remember the verse. But I don't know if somebody has come across that because I don't think Allah can ever say something like that that Christians should stick to what they believe in. But I don't. I, I also don't think the woman is lying. Maybe she she didn't really say it word for word as she saw it in the Quran. But this was an interesting one. I wish she was able to say a lot of things about Christianity, about the, about Jesus, the crucifixion, Trinity, you know, what it means to, you know, experience the Holy Spirit, what it means to, you know, I was expecting more of that from her, but, well, like I said earlier, maybe she was under pressure, but this was a beautiful one. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.